Are you in need of money? Is there something you want to buy or someone you have to pay? Then this revolutionary book, Cryptocurrency by Kakrabaden, is what you are looking for. It will unlock sources of money you have but don't know you possess. You are just a book away from turning your finances around. Order the book Cryptocurrency, How to Profit from Free Labor through the following means. Place your order on Facebook by posting Order Cryptocurrency in the comment section or message window. We also deliver worldwide. This message is brought to you by the friends and partners of Kakra Baden. Welcome to Air Power with Kakra Baden, teaching the nations with signs and wonders. Kakra is the senior pastor of the Catch the Anointing Center, Accra, Ghana. Now, today's message. Welcome to today's broadcast. Kakra has been sharing an insightful message titled The Art of Hearing under the subtitle How to Recognize the Voice of God. Today, he speaks about the voice of God and power. Come along. Number five. When God speaks, he carries power. Hebrews chapter 4 verse 12 it says, The word of God is quick and powerful. Exodus chapter 8 verse 4, it says, Where the word of the king is, there is power. When God speaks. You know, when Jesus was anointed at the River Jordan, Luke 3, 22, the Bible says, the Holy Ghost descended in their bodily shape like a dove upon him. There came a voice from heaven which said, thou art my beloved son in whom I am well pleased. He moved in faith immediately. He has never preached before. He has never healed the sick before, but he went into the temple. God, God has spoken to him and it requires faith. Luke 4, 18 said, the spirit of the Lord is upon me because he has anointed me to preach the gospel to the poor and to heal Someone who has never healed anybody before. He said, I'm a healer. In the spirit realm, you don't have to be something before you say it. You say it before you become that thing. It's the reverse. Then he started preaching the word of God. Look at verse 32. And they were, they were astonished at his doctrine. For his word was with Whatever thing that God says, he will perform it. When I fire a bullet, I don't have to go and help the bullet and be pushing it for it to be going. When I fire it, it will go by itself. You don't fire a bullet and say, let me help you on your way. It needs no help. So when God speaks, there is power behind it. So shall my word be, Isaiah 55 verse 11, that goeth forth out of my mouth. It shall not return unto me void. It shall accomplish that which I please. In other words, God said, when I speak, there is enough power in it. It's self-reliant, self-sufficient to do anything. That is why when you read the scriptures, there is nobody that God spoke to and God told the person, wait, I'm going to the bank to get a loan. Wait, I'm going to look for people to come and help you. Wait, we have to do this special, uh, we have to organize something special to come and help you. Every time God will ask you, what is in your hand? And Moses said, a rod, a chewing stick. He says, all right, it's enough. Because when God speaks, there is enough power behind it. It doesn't need anything again. So Luke 4, 32, the Bible says, when the word of God started coming, the people were astonished. The word of God, when it comes, it comes with power, transformational powers. So as you are sitting here, it's not just stories. When he spoke to Moses, immediately great power came into that road. Signs and wonders follow it. So sometimes when you think God has spoken to you and you are moving, there's no grace, there's no power behind it. Stop. 
Maybe it's your mind. Because you can make a mistake. You can make a genuine mistake. But to persist stubbornly when there is no power, there's something wrong. Sometimes it is clear that this one, God is not in it. It's time to say I made a mistake. I thought I heard God's voice, but I didn't hear it. Thanks for tuning in. Today we learned that one feature of the voice of God is that it carries the power of God. Join us same time tomorrow for the continuation of this message. Before we go, here's a praise report to boost your faith. My dad is completely healed. Dear Kakra, my dad was not able to walk and even though he had been to hospitals, his situation was getting worse. I wrote to you to pray for him and you did. To the glory of God, he's completely healed. God be praised. Thanks for your time. You can contact us, seek counseling, ask for prayer, order today's full length message or order books through the following means. Call us or message us on WhatsApp to plus 233 55 700 90 10. Send an email to info at .org. You can also make a regular call or send a text to plus 233 Our office hours are 10 a.m. to 1600 hours GMT. Finally, write to us, share your testimony and how this broadcast has been a blessing to you.